Hello, hello, it's Mel from A Little Something. Um, I have another journal to show you. This is probably one of my favorites. Yeah, it probably is. So um, this is again a love story from Ephemera's Vintage Garden. I think it's, uh, I hope I'm getting this right. And it is a cardstock um, book cover that I painted in gold. And I've done um, like a vintage uh Mod Pod. I have it here actually. Just this stuff was not not antique, not vintage, antique mat, which I found at my local craft store, and I was a very happy bunny. And a lace closure that I just it didn't fit a hitch post. Just it just oozed lace. So, and I've like tea stained this. This is very cute, very lovely. So. A bit of doily this is prima paper and I've done something a bit kind of different so what I've done is I've made pockets so out of transfer paper so tracing tracing paper I need to have a big sign tracing paper so this kit comes with like file folders which I think are beautiful and envelopes so most of most of the journaling like bits are all in here and I just this is a real like like love letter kind of feel kind of journal so this is about your secret thoughts and feelings and just to have them in here and I've got a few of these pockets um I love I just love this kit so some journals so there are some areas just for journaling now I've stamped just um I've, I've uh, just done some lines on here that I've stamped on here again an envelope with some more journal paper in put that back well I will you don't want me to watch me do that I've done some hole punching in the corners it's just beautiful and again some stamping of some lines some more file folders with some more paper colored paper I think this is like Lello yellow Lello another some more of the of the digi kit again some stamping for lines they're quite small lines which I kind of like actually um, again file folder with some more paper envelope now I have stuck it this in here now it doesn't really go so if you don't want it in just take it out but it's good paper and it's in there so and I had it so I threw it in again another file folder with really crispy dark journaling paper so um, there's well over like like 40 kind of journaling pages in here in all the like different file folders and envelopes. And again, another envelope. Whoops. Wait, oh, let's see. I think I put four in each one. There's two and an index card. But I think I put like four in each one other than this one so there's quite a bit and then some more oh just tape bogey and more journaling and more journaling and more I think I used eight pieces of transfer paper tracing oh my gosh tracing paper again maybe there's three pieces I don't know I don't think I kept tabs I just know I put lot. I, I was generous. Okay. More. Am I in frame? I am. And oh, isn't this just beautiful? Like, give me a break. Like, this stuff is beautiful. Her envelopes. <laughs> this doesn't really want to come out, which is interesting. I will have to figure out what is wrong. Hang on. Ah, because I had a card in here. Again, index card and some... It looks like I've done three. 
and the end and a doily so again I've done a bit of stitching this is just beautiful I just I love this journal I absolutely love it so um, again if this is something you want in your life I sell on, et on Etsy I don't sell on Etsy I can't trust myself to keep an Etsy shop so I sell on eBay thank you very much um, I've linked it below as well as the links of the the real link of the digi kit <laughs> um, because my brain has is Swiss cheese. Swiss cheese brain. So anyways, thank you very much for watching and we'll see you again. Bye.